Hey, sneaking us back in the house, back in the house. Today we are with Nopix 8.1, the live media distro, basically. It's meant to be run live, but you can get persistence in the USB drive now, which is what I've got it on now. So I'll quickly open up the browser and show you a quick something there before we go anywhere else. We'll go to the Nopix site and you have a look. As you can see, it's in Deutschland, okay, German. Okay. We'll go to the English section. And it tells you all about it here and how it's going. If we go to Nopix info, what is it? When was it around from? Blah de blah de blah de blah de blah, etc. There's loads here. You can download a disc if you want to, etc. etc. It's entirely up to you. But hey, just download it here. Blum 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 blum. Out of all these places, plenty. FTP and HTTP. Whatever you want to do, really. Hmm. So yes, Chromium is your browser of choice. With ad blocker. Mm -mm -mm. Excuse me. Oh, did you see? Compiz is by default. Mmm, compiz, yeah. Why do you want to do that by default? I don't know. But hey, hey, it makes it a bit different, I suppose, doesn't it? Now, I start, started my Linux life on Nopix many, many, many moons ago. Okay, this is how I first got into Linux. I just see this disc on the front of a magazine. I will I'll give, it, give that a go. And the thing that amazed me about it, it was it came with, listen, it came with everything you needed or could possibly want on live media and you could use it whereas with the old windows that i had before which is windows 98 you have to install everything and install this and install that but this just went there you go here's all your stuff go and use it which is why i liked it so much so it's lxde at the end of the day with a bit of mate thrown in okay i've added some things to the panel down here like a weather applet and a temperature applet for my temperature from my cpu we're at 36 degrees i think i recorded in at 60 frames a second i can't remember who knows who knows, who knows, who knows. Um, and that's about it. That's all I've installed. Oh, the other thing I did install was Simple Screen Recorder because it had recorded my desktop, but that would have been quite slow. So we, we gave up on that one. We just, oh, just got this one to make it easier. So this is running from live media on a USB key. Now, you get persistence with it, okay? As I said before, persistence, persistence, persistence. So I've got a 16 gig key here. And I've still got 10 gig of free space. So that's plenty, isn't it? I made the video folder basically, so the video will go into it. That's, that's all. No reason why. The so compass, a bit like Wayne's World, isn't it? Right. It's what you want to see, isn't it? Now this is the menu of Nopix. B B B B B. Amazed. Okay. Accessories. Look at all that. Look at it all. Look. There's everything you can possibly want or need already there for you. So we we'll start up here. Uh, archive manager, as you would not. Emacs is here. GUI and terminal and text max. Oh my god! Image viewer. Kai alarm. Kate. Kakout. Kakasata. Key pass. Keep my password safe. Keep Good shots. Keep Petra. Coming at you. Oh yeah. Okay. As you can see, it has its roots in old school, old style KDE, which is like pre-Trinity and pre-anything else. It was like, is it KDE 2 or KDE 3? But the real old style. And that's why you've got all this stuff here, basically, at the end of the day. You know, so much case. And you get a leaf pad as well, anyway. Yeah, leaf pad, yeah. There. Basically all you need. But what Nopix does, it gives you more than what you need. It gives you probably far too much, really, to be honest with you. I mean, you've got Sweeper down here. I mean, do you need that, really? Vim as well. Oh, my God. Wine tricks, because wine's installed by default. Really? Really and truly, mind you, saying that, bearing in mind, if you've got a USB 3 key and you've got a 128 gig disk, like USB key, which I know about 30 quid, isn't it? That could be quite a little, nice little system, really, couldn't it? Anyway, education, blinking, G compress, oh, yes, yeah, that's good for little kiddies, okay. Calgebra, Calasium, right, that doesn't work. It doesn't work, no, it doesn't work. It doesn't work at all, no. Canagram. K brush is all practicey stuff, okay. Kitten, Ketris, K stars, okay, K stars, okay. It's like a little planetarium, basically. They load up for you. Yeah, we're close that guy. Okay. And basically, you can look at the sky at night, wherever you are in the world, or what what you can see from where you are. So I'm rotating. There's nothing really to see really. Is there really? Is there oh the neb? The neb? I thought that was in a game I played, the neb. It is, isn't it? So I'll move that in here. And uh, is that an asteroid moon or something? I can't remember. Will I get a close-up photo? No, because it's moving now. Because it's actually in real time. Look, 
Bye. You can't even call me now until tomorrow. Okay. So that works for Hunky Dory. So yeah, it's very interesting. Okay. Down the bottom here we get tux oh tux type in and tux math do work, okay. I suppose you want to see, didn't you? Okay, tux type. Okay. You can hear the music coming up, my headphones in the background. But basically this is tux type. Using education all the time. So fish cascade we're gonna do. We'll go to medium and we'll go to fruit and see how bad my spelling is. Okay, so what you do, you wait. Oh, orange. Can you see that? Orange? You have to spell it. Okay. Apple. Raspberry. We do know these ones, isn't it? And basically, oh, blueberry. Another one. Okay, blueberry. These are good for kids if you've got kids at home, actually. And I actually spelled that wrong, did you see? So you won't be able to eat the fish. That's how basically there it goes. So we come out of that. Come out of that. Go back to the main menu. You've seen it work. That's enough, isn't it, really? Works super fine. Okay. Okay, well, that's about it for that one. Games. All old school games. And this guy, actually. So if I go to the bottom, we work my way up, I think. Okay. Okay, Sket. Chess. Tux Puck. Play Shuffle Puck with Tux. Tower Toppler. Tetravex. Same game. Potato Guy. Never ball. I mean, you must remember never ball or never putt. Yeah, should we go with never ball, never putt? We'll play. We we'll go that one. I've not done this for ages, by the way, guys. Oh yeah, what you do? You ah oh, no, I forgot. It's you're supposed to draw it back. That ain't gonna work. Oh, beauties. I'll give that one. Next. Okay. Oh, it was down here, wasn't we? Go back down here. Okay. Well, uh. Lin City, another nice one to play. Mahjong, Mines, Naval Battle, which is like, you know what it is. K Squares, K Sudoku, okay, Reversi, Patience, Conquest, Kulf. Oh, going back to the Ks again now. I'm choking on the K. Blimey. Gold Runner, and Four in a Line, and Diamond, and Breakout, and Bounce, even. Yes, they're all there, okay. Atomic, okay. Then we've got the usual Frozen Bubble, Free Civ Server and Free Civ GTK3, Extreme Tax Racer, so you can press again, of course, and Dots, uh, Docs, I can't even talk today, DOS Box to run old DOS games like Theme Hospital. Do you remember that? I used to love that game. Old Bombers here and that as well. And the graphics, a bit smaller this time, but you get Blender, okay, Blender's here, open Blender up. See, Blender opens up nice. It's 278 as well, blimey. Somebody's been on the old Coke, can I? Coke Coda, I meant, by the way. Free CADs here as well. Uh, digital Camera Browser, K Ruler, Office Draw, Scribus, Simple Scan. Open Scribus up for you. Scribus, open sort of desktop publishing program that I've used to use quite a lot when I used to do a lot of uh, posters and double sided stuff. It works super fine, trust me. It's well worth the effort using it. Mm -hmm. Same as Blender. Well worth the effort using it and learning it. But if you want to learn Blender, it's a very uphill struggle. Again, okay. Where else was I? Okay. Uh, there's a Nopix section here anyway. Your antivirus scanners here again. Install components, root shell, Samba server. Tor proxy. Ooh, is that any? Of course it's not. It's totally legal. Here's all your office stuff, right? The full LibreOffice suite. Plus dictionaries, home bank, genumeric. No heavy word. Ooh, not very so a text maker, a PDF chain. Nice. Works. Bluefish for programming. Servizer. Eclipse. Genie. Emacs of Satubi 4. QT4 and QT5 assistants and designers. Squeak and Umbrella. Now, under sound and video, get Elsa Mixer, of course. Amrock. Nice little player. Audacity, of course. AU Mix. Yes, simple program. It does the job. Cheese. Brazero. A daisy player for your books. K3B. Now we're going back to K's again. Look, like caffeine and Aiden Live and Kino and K Mix and oh, media too. And MuTV. Open shot by default as well as Caden Live. So that's super duper, isn't it? Anyway, that's all I'm going to show you for now because I'll go on forever and ever. Go and download it. Give it a go. Super duper. Sneaky looks out. As it is. Bye bye.